Okay, Curtis Life and Services coming to you live once again. Uh, this is a heating and air conditioning system I put in uh, back around 2004. Uh, and what we're looking at now, uh, this is a two-zone system. Uh, so downstairs is one zone, upstairs is another zone. And this is the transition that uh, I had to make to get the uh, supply air and return air up to the second floor because there were there was no path through the uh, center of the house, closet, uh, what have you, wasn't available. So I had to uh, design, I had to design a transition. And as you can see, this is a two-story house, quite a big house, and this is some of my sheet metal expertise. And as you can see, custom-made fresh air intake. Yes, sir. Bringing in the 40% makeup air that every structure should have. And here's my exhaust vent. Uh, as you can see, the house has been painted since then, but that's my exhaust vent for the furnace. Okay. Then, come around the corner. This is the uh, five tank condenser I installed, air ease. And that's my disconnect. I don't know if you can see, but this is my line set going to the unit. And I came back to install them a tankless water heater. And as you can see, uh, the beginning stages of the tankless. And let's go inside. They have a very beautiful backyard. Very beautiful. Wow, I love coming here. It's so peaceful. Yes, if you're going to work, you might as well be in a peaceful environment. And this is uh, right over in Mandana, uh, right around the corner from Lake Merritt. So this is a beautiful area anyway. Uh, I had to thread a lot of gas pipes yesterday. So uh, this is my tripod. And you're looking at... Uh, Unistrut bar. Uh, I use Unistrut to secure my pipe to the wall where it looks nice and professional. Okay, so let's walk around here and I'll show you what's going on. This is the water heater that I'm taking out. Uh, it's no longer needed because uh, we're upgrading to a tankless. And as you can see, this water heater has a circulating pump on it. I may use the uh, circulating pump on the uh, tankless. I may not. All depends on if I need to. Okay, and then uh, we're coming in gas-wise with a one inch. Uh, I ran one inch all the way to the tankless, and then I dropped it down to three quarter. Being that the tankless is 190,000 BTU, the furnace is 110,000 BTU. And the furnace and the tankless is the only thing uh, on this gas line, and this line comes straight off the meter. So I can control my BTU uh, demands. And this is my baby. I installed her quite some time ago, and she still looks like she's brand new. Pretty big, pretty big furnace. And what you're looking at right there, that's my electronic air cleaner. Because uh, my customers, you know, they have respiratory problems, so I gave them a premium filtration system. Yeah. Okay. And this is a custom transition. Uh, a buddy of mine made. And this is a transition for the uh, upstairs. We're bringing uh, the current air off of it. And okay, so I'm going to sign out right now. And uh, 
get back to work, I need to make a material list so I can go get the last of the uh, material. But there you go. Okay, and I always put a light by my furnace. Okay, here's the uh, zone panel I installed, you know, along with some SSUs. Uh, I have a uh, rooftop exhaust fans, low profile, three times. I uh, have two of them, rooftop. And that was to help with the upstairs because during the summertime, the upstairs was getting to about 110 degrees. So it needed help. Uh, had the AC running constantly. So now, since I've installed those fans, exhaust fans, sets uh, the heat out the attic, which in return cools the second floor that much more better, and it cuts the runtime of the AC in half, okay? And I did all of this. And here's my uh, mechanical panels. Here's my mechanical panels uh, that I installed to run the uh, HVAC equipment. And as you can see, pretty good electrician. Pretty good electrician. And bam, bam, bam. Okay, and let me show you this stuff in here. Okay, there's, you see all that? Yeah, that's all mechanical. Okay, so I'm going to sign out right now. I'm going to sign out.